Hi, I'm Steve Good, and I write the Scroll Saw Workshop blog. You can visit my website at www.scrollsawworkshop.blogspot.com. Tonight, I want to continue a series that I started a couple weeks ago, and that is to take uh, you all to see uh, some of the better scroll saw sites that I've found on the web over the years. And uh, this week, I want to take you to a website in Spain, uh, and the, the URL is www.findscrollsaw.com. Now, this website was put together by a gentleman named Pedro, and uh, he has done the scrolling community uh, just an incredible favor by taking some of the old uh, uh, masterpiece scroll saw patterns uh, from old books and restored them using uh, modern day computer tools uh, so that other scrollers can uh, do the type of fretwork that was done in the past from some of the masters. And I want to take you through his website today and just show you a couple of examples of what Pedro has been able to accomplish. Uh, the first thing I want to do is start you out here on his home page and uh, show you some of the scroll saw fretwork examples that uh, people who have uh, purchased these patterns from Pedro uh, have sent him pictures of and also just some other fine fretwork. Now, as you open this page up, there's a lot of graphics on it, so if you have a fairly slow connection, be patient, because it's going to take this page a while to load. But this first uh, uh, scroll saw uh, fretwork pattern here is uh, one of the more incredible that you'll ever see, especially when you find out that this pattern or project was actually cut by a hand saw, uh, not with one of the modern day scroll saws. Uh, so as you scroll down and look at this, you'll see that this was a uh, pattern that was produced by uh, a master Italian scroller uh, back about a hundred years ago and these pictures were sent to Pedro by a gentleman who put it together and produced this uh, pattern by using a hand saw. 3,700 pieces so you can imagine the effort and the skill that went into taking uh, this pattern to uh, a completion. As you scroll down you'll see some of the other incredible pictures that Pedro has been sent that were produced by some of the patterns on his website and look at the craftsmanship in many of these pieces really gives you the ideal of the quality of workmanship that scrollers around the world can produce if you like fretwork type patterns uh, this site is going to keep you interested for uh, many hours so I want to just rapidly scroll down to give you a little bit of an idea of what's here some of the work that's been produced and sent to Pedro and you can see just incredible stuff. Okay, now we'll move back to Pedro's home page. The next uh, section down are the free scroll saw fretwork patterns that Pedro has available on his site. Now these are patterns that have been reproduced uh, with the permission from the copyright holder from some of the uh, old scroll saw books that Pedro's have collected over the years. And as you scroll down, you'll see a thumbnail of the different uh, patterns that he has. Now these patterns are going to be large so you're going to you're not going to be able to print them out on a typical printer. You're going to have to take most of these PDF uh, files to a uh, uh, a copy center to have them printed. But uh, if you scroll down through here you'll see that there's some really beautiful works and as you go down you can see some of the pictures some from these patterns that have been created from the patterns themselves. And as you can see, you're going to find some works here that uh, you'll really enjoy putting together. So this part of the website right here is well worth the trip over to Pedro's site just to look and uh, pick up some of these free patterns. Okay, moving back over to the home page again. These are some of the scroll saw fretwork patterns that Pedro has recreated and has available for sale on his site. And there's a beautiful little basket. Uh, there's the Victorian Bridge. I know many of you have probably seen that on the web if you've looked around. The Eiffel Tower project, that's a beautiful piece. The Ferris wheel, uh, I've seen that several places. And uh, just uh, look down through these patterns. The prices on these patterns is, are, are very good and uh, absolutely beautiful work. Some of these uh, pieces would look uh, beautiful and talk about a lot of fun. Cutting this pattern out right here would just be uh, uh, a tremendous amount of joy. Some of the work that he has down through here. Just incredible. If you want to uh, spend a bunch of hours on your scroll saw, 
producing some of this beautiful work, I highly recommend that you jump over to Pedro's website and see if you can uh, get some of these patterns from him because there's years of enjoyment here in these patterns. You could spend your whole retirement just building the patterns on Pedro's site. Again, I'm just scrolling down to show you some of the examples that he has here. This one right here, this pot stand. I think that is a beautiful piece. I would love to build that one myself. Doesn't take long on this website to realize that it's a gold mine. Look at all these beautiful patterns. This Russian basket right here, incredible. Look at the detail of the fretwork on that pattern. That's a beautiful piece. And it just goes on and on. So uh, stop by this website and take a look at some of his patterns. You might want to buy some. I highly recommend you do. You're going to find uh, just about everything you could uh, want. Here's a, He shows some of his new patterns here on his uh, front page. Uh, here's what he calls a pharmacy cabinet. That's a beautiful piece. Look at that. Okay, uh, Pedro, back to his web, his home page here. Uh, Pedro uses the Hegner scroll saw, and uh, he recommends it. He says he likes it very well. This is a saw that I personally have never had an opportunity to use, but I know it gets a lot of uh, high reviews. So he goes through and gives you some of the uh, detailed pictures of the scroll saw, um, the blade change, and uh, if you're interested in this saw, this would be a good place to come take a quick look at it. And he has a site map where he shows uh, all the different free patterns, his patterns for sale, historical books, shopping recommendations, uh, questions and answers, links, uh, just about everything that uh, you would want to enjoy in a scroll saw is here on Pedro's site. So if you're interested in intricate fretwork type patterns, uh, Pedro's site is one of the best I've found on the web. Uh, please stop by and uh, drop him an email. Tell him how much you appreciate his work. I know uh, I sure do. Um, I go and study the, the patterns that he has, the free patterns, just to study the fretwork to try to improve my own uh, fretwork uh, designing capabilities. So it's been a gold mine for me, and I'm sure it will be for you. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this little video tour of Pedro's site. It's www.findscrollsaw.com. Uh, stop by, drop Pedro an email, and uh, tell him I sent you. And uh, hope you enjoyed this video tour, and we'll see you next week at the Scroll Saw Workshop.